Hey, look at the new car, everybody. Finally got the CRV. S2K, meet the CRV. All right, we'll talk about this a little bit more once I get home from work, because right now I'm on my way to work and I'm pretty much running late. But I wanted you guys to see the new wet. But yeah, man, your boy's super excited about this. It's definitely gonna be a working project, but I can't wait to get started on it. It's gonna be something to do over the winter time. Because for right now, the S2K is kind of where I want it, besides getting the turbo kit and like more engine mods. But, you know, I kind of want to take my time with that. I don't want to rush it. So, the CRV is going to be something that we're going to be working on over the winter. Maybe a nice system and, you know, all that good jazz. And it's uh, uh, 2,000. 2,000, 119,000 miles. So, that's even better because the element had like 153. So, you know, I'm going to take my time and not like go stupid crazy overboard with the uh with the crv but like i still want to make it you know mine and i want to make it look good so we're gonna have some you know work to do i don't know if i'm gonna put like actual wheels on there or if i'm gonna put like some accord sport wheels or maybe civic si wheels like the newer ones like a 09 civic si uh wheel i love i used to love those wheels i still do or i might just do like the basic MB battles or something you know like I want mine to look good it's a 4x4 four four, so it's all-wheel drive which I'm excited about because the element was front-wheel drive and yeah so we got a little bit of work to do don't worry guys it's it, it's gonna be fun I hope that you guys enjoy this I feel like I might bring some new people to the channel too because you know not a lot of people are up on CRVs and I feel like a lot of people might want to get one after they see what I do to mine yo what's up everyone so your boys officially off work I actually went and got the uh, CRV registered and insured and everything on my lunch break today. Um, I didn't record it. I just kind of wanted to get there and get back. Pretty was It was pretty quick in and out and everything like that. So now I'm about to head on home. So I already have one of the plates on. I don't know if I have any brackets for the front plate. So I don't got to put any plates on. But I want to wash the car. The car is so dirty. But um, I vacuumed it last night. And I want to figure out like what kind of amplifier and like... Uh, maybe like a nice another another like maybe two 12 inch subs for the rear end of the car I'm trying to do like a nice audio setup in this car So I don't know we got a lot of we got a lot of options a lot of things that I want to do I already talked to mark. We're gonna get this interior pop in everything So I feel like these videos will be dope over the winter time and don't forget like I'm not gonna forget about the s2k I know everyone's like really watching me before for the s2k, but like I said, my channel's all around, man, and I want to have fun, and I want to do what I want to do. So, I hope you guys, you know, stick around, hang out with your boy, and watch the progression of this CRV. all right? I'm telling y'all, after I'm done with my CRV, watch. Mad other people are going to want CRVs. I'm telling you. Sometimes it's dope to step outside the box and do things that other people aren't doing, you know? Like, right now, everyone, all the YouTubers are buying, like, drift cars and 240s and, like... You know like that whole realm of things i kind of just want to do something different you know i want to do something that not everyone's doing not everyone's like you know the biggest trend and everything like that i want to make my own trend i want to make it be cool to be like a honda guy i want it to be cool to own things that most people won't look at you know same thing when i bought my ruckus or the grom like most people weren't really looking into them and then like i started riding them around town i started meeting more people we made it cool in new jersey and a lot of more people just started riding them and having fun so you know i just want to bring light to the honda community and i just want to you know let everyone see that not all the all hondas are whack or like however you know other haters of hondas feel about our cars or whatever but you know i just like i said i just want to be different interior of the car is so clean bro super clean super clean nice first things first we got to get that headliner i want to get that headliner done just hose it down give it a nice little soap down oh man like i said crv is a work in progress we got a lot to do new headlights everything it's gonna be a whole makeover for this car promise i just hope you guys are ready and stay tuned because it's about to get lit. Alright, just finished 
washing down the car. Like I said, it is a work in progress. We do have a lot of work to do. Well, I mean, I have a lot of work to do. But you guys are part of the fam too, so y'all part of this travels too. Like right here, if you guys could look real close, it's like a rust spot right there. Uh, the paint, it's all right. You know what I mean? It's a daily, so I'm not gonna go overboard, but I might send it to Mako, get like a little quick $500 spray paint job. You know what I mean? Just something easy, simple. All right, so right now, this system in the CRV is kicking my ass, bro. I can't get the subwoofer to kick on. I don't know why. All the RCA jacks that's in the rear was already there, so I thought it was just all plug and play. So I'm trying to figure out what goes to what, but to me, it's showing like nothing is working right now. Like the amplifier and everything cuts on, but the, the subwoofer isn't cutting on. And I'm not sure as to why it's not cutting on. All right, so your boy figured it out. CRV, woo, it knocks, boy. Hopefully I'm not overpowering MP's music back there, but uh, the CRV, it's a whole lot of gang shit about to happen. Hey, 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 hey. So now the only thing we have to do is figure out this power wire right here, how we can get it to keep it inside. Because right now, this gauge on this is super thick and the the uh, connection that it uses, we had to like grind down so it's not really staying in place because it's not allowing this screw to go down all the way and tighten. So MP's thinking about just shaving down some of the wiring and then making his own connector and then using that. But the uh, CRV, shit knocks bro. All of this is the previous owner's wiring. It was a lot of like craziness in there, but uh, I figured it out and then um, yeah, it's good money now. So we just have to make sure everything's copacetic with this power wire because I don't want it to trip out and then like make something catch fire or something like that. So that's like the main concern, but this thing knocks. The speakers back here sound crazy. The speakers up front sound good too. Damn, this 350Z right here is looking mighty crazy. Damn. This looks crazy. I think MP just got it all like aligned up and ready for the track tomorrow. Voltex wing on and everything. It's even got the rear uh, window plexiglass. Full cage, everything. Thing is mad, bro. This is nice. Nice as hell. I like this. Carbon doors. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's carbon. This is fire. Ooh, carbon over there too. Nice. This is nice. I'm guessing this blue uh, bride seats in here. Cage everything, man. The Voltex wing has another attachment to it for more aerodynamics. This is fire. I'm really, really rocking with this. Oh, Nismo. Then we got the CRV back here with the bass booming. Mark's GTR. Fire squad. Alright, so everything's tucked up, tucked away. Now the sub is just right there by itself. We're gonna have some good blast on the way home. So, with that being said, I'm gonna call it a night. I'm gonna get back on my grind time. I have actually another video that I have to edit for you guys. I've been vlogging, I just haven't been editing anything. But, um, yeah. If you guys enjoyed this video, 
Don't forget to subscribe, alright? And smash that like button. Peace.